and welcome back to another video. If you're new here, my name is Rami and I share lots of vegan content and tips to help you live well. And today we're gonna to be making chocolate chip cookies. If you know anything about me or you follow me on Instagram, you know that I absolutely love chocolate chip cookies. There's something about them. They're just so classic, so delicious, never let you down, just <laughs> the best dessert. So today I wanna to share my recipe with you. They are so yummy, but they're also secretly super healthy. They're vegan, gluten-free, refined sugar-free, and made without any added oils, but they're still super soft, chewy, with crisp edges, and they actually remind me of Mrs. Fields chocolate chip cookies or the chocolate chip cookies at Subway Sandwich. They're honestly so good, so I wanted to show you guys how to make them, and I will leave the link to the recipe in the description box below. Let's get baking. The beautiful thing about this recipe is that it comes together in one bowl. So we're starting off with some creamy roasted almond butter. I like to use an unsweetened, unsalted variety because we're gonna add our own sweetener. So we're using maple syrup. You could also use another liquid sweetener of choice, but this is my personal favorite, along with a little bit of vanilla extract and flax egg, which is basically just ground flax seeds mixed with water. We're gonna give everything a good stir until it's evenly combined, and then we're gonna move on to adding some of our dry ingredients to the mix. I'm using coconut sugar, but you could also use brown sugar if you prefer, and we're just going to incorporate this until it's completely smooth, making sure to scrape down the edges of the bowl as well. Now we're ready to move on to the flowers. So I'm using a mix of oat flour and a little bit of almond flour, which is really important for the texture in the end result. We're also adding baking powder and baking soda and just stirring again until completely smooth and evenly combined. Once the dough is ready, we're gonna add our vegan chocolate chips. I really like to use these mini sized ones. I feel like they do the best job when it comes to cookies. And we're gonna fold this in. You can add as much or as little as you'd like. And as you can see, the texture of the dough is thick, but a little bit sticky. So I like to pop it in the fridge before I roll them into balls. Now we're going to evenly place them on a baking tray, pop them in the oven, and you get these beautifully golden brown chocolate chip cookies with a little bit of a crispy edge and the perfect soft texture. Right, guys don't forget to check out the description box below i will leave a link to the recipe for you guys there and if you make them don't forget to tag me on instagram or send me a dm show me your delicious cookies and let me know what you think i also wanted to say a huge thank you to you guys we reached a hundred thousand subscribers that's a lot of people i have a fun one plan that'll probably go up within the next week or so in celebration of 100k i couldn't be more grateful and i will see you guys again next week with some more videos bye